Hi, welcome to a part for you video tutorials. This video tutorial is on how to repair your tumble dryer when it's not heating. Uh, make sure the appliance is disconnected from the electricity and all work should be done by a qualified person. Right, got the tumble dryer running here and left it running for a couple of minutes and there's no heat. One of the common problems with this is it could be one of the thermostats. There's usually two or three thermostats fitted on most tumble dryers or it is possible that the element is blown uh, therefore you need to replace the element first thing we're going to do here is inspect the element and the rear thermostat on this machine by disconnecting the rear panel Once we've taken this panel off, you will have clear visibility at the heating element. There you go, back panels come off. Now you can see the element here. And underneath it, you can see a cutout thermostat. What we'll do is take the heating element off now to test the thermostat and the heating element. Right, just having a quick clean up as there's a lot of fluff and uh, dust uh, that comes off the clothing. One of the things that you should do when Stripping the machine down is always uh, try and hoover up as much as possible um, because it is a fire hazard. Okay, two screws holding this element in place. We'll just remove these. There are different arrangements on different tumble dryers. We will be doing some on the Creda uh, and Hot Point ones at a later stage. And also some of the condenser dryers we'll do some videos of as well. Basically the same principle throughout. Right, you can see here the cutout thermostat. We'll disconnect the two wires off this to test this first to see if this is the problem make sure you mark up the uh, wires where they came off now with the electrical meter we will test the thermostat for continuity As you can see on the two connections here, the meter's not moving at all. Now if you have continuity, by touching the two probes together, you will see the, that we have continuity. But the thermostat itself looks like the problem on this. So what we'll do is replace the thermostat now. Now these thermostats uh, go one of the major reasons that they uh, go is because people have a tendency to open the door before it has its 10 minute cooling off period so therefore the thermostat is constantly getting clicked in and clicked out um, which will cause over a period of time for the thermostat to actually um, wear out just supporting it slightly I 
and we'll just test it now it's in place as you can see it's got a circuit now so we didn't need to replace the heating element so I'll make a separate video on this on how to change the element because there is uh, some wiring that needs to be detached from the inside of the machine but we'll show you this in another video connect the wires back up remember to put them exactly as they came off and there you go new thermostat fitted remember you can get all these parts at our website www.apart4u.co.uk or .com Thermostats are not very expensive, they're normally around between 10 and 20 pounds for the set some manufacturers can be a little more and some uh, heating elements I must point out uh, are not supplied by the manufacturers without the heating element so you have to buy the thermostat and the heating element all together and the best way of finding your parts is uh, to type the model number into our website and then it usually gives you a full list but if you can't find the part you're after just give us a telephone call and we should have it in stock giving it a good clean and hoover here I find these Henry machines brilliant uh, vacuums for the workshop they're made by pneumatic and again as much fluff as you possibly can remove the air take that goes through to the front door there you can see worth getting the vacuum cleaner right down to clean it as it's uh, a common place where the fluff can build up and cause restrictions the more restriction you have on the tumble dryer uh, the more prone you are to getting these problems because the thermostats will be cutting in and out m much more and it's very important for you to keep the fluff filters on the front of the machines completely clear so literally after every load of washing uh, it's worth just giving it a quick wipe down replacing the back panel now then we'll plug the machine in and test it these little compacts are nice to uh, use for video as they're easy to handle there we go turn the tumble dryer on give it three four minutes once it's heated up you can check that it's heating and there you go if you need help on changing your element remember all video tutorials are at our website and remember to shop at Apart For You as that's what keeps us going and able to make these videos for you. We hope you found this helpful.